Welcome to this tutorial on how you can create your own UI.sarc file. So, what you have to do is to, the first thing you need to do is install the program. So, what you need is an image editor. So, I will use um, I will use GIMP. You need every file explorer, and you need Cookie, which is part of Kudimu. I'll leave uh, a download link in the description. Oh, you also need my stuff tools, but that's an optional thing. But it's just recommended. Um, so first of all, start by extracting the BCLAM files. So go into menu.ses, which you can get in a dump. If you yeah, you need to uh, you need to dump your RomaFS by the way to get the files, of course. And we need a specific amount of UI files. So if you just want a character, um, we need to first of all extract select so i'll be modding yoshi I'll, i made a, a yellow yoshi so i'm going to make ui for that so just search select yoshi so there he is select yoshi.bclm then click on export so right click export and then export it into like a folder then the next one which you need also a menu.ses is rank yoshi we go and then we go over to race.ses which is another um, UI file so UI no archive oh, no, it's not your no archive never mind um, there race.ses then search for again rank because there's another rank file in race which is actually rotated 90 degrees for some reason so everything in race.ses or sns however you say it is always rotated 90 degrees so just export ring usually r90 into the same folder and then also the map icon so map yoshi that's also r90 so now you have all the files um, you can also do it for cards, by the way. Um, if you want to do cards, you need to search for BSTD. Um, but that's a menu as it is, by the way. I'm doing it in the, the wrong file. So BSTD, these are the cards, as you can see. So just extract that and then um, edit it as you want. So, and gliders is G, GSTD. So, now that we have all the um, the images I'm going to cookie and then going to I'm, I'm going to just extract all of them at the same time so just batch batch export png and we're going to um yellow yoshi ui there and then it's going to batch export the pngs and then with the pngs i'll just cut them to a different folder so it's easier to view because now there are no previews. So I'm just gonna make a folder called PNG. And I'm just gonna put them in there. And then there are previews. So there he is, as you can see. So I'm just gonna open him in GIMP. And um, I'm gonna zoom in. And I'm just gonna do a simple U shift. So it's gonna make him from green to yellow. Um, yeah, you gotta find the right tint. So this is a bit hard to find the right tint for him, but this will do. So I'm gonna just export him. And then do the same thing with the others. So that's good. So as you can see, it's uh, he's rotated. Um, this I, I probably won't um, 
I probably oh, I probably will not uh, do it again I'll just for easier sake I will just rotate this one 90 degrees back so minus 90 and then just remove him from the background so that's rank Yoshi and then we also have map Yoshi I might improve him later on, but it's just an example. So, now I'm gonna get them back. I'm gonna get them back in this folder. Let's just remove PNG. So, then I'm gonna go back to Cookie, and we're going to batch import PNG. And then it will import them back in. Also, I should mention something. Um, for the most recent update from CTGP7. So, if this here, so it needs to be encoded RGBA444, or 4444, <laughs> um, just said the RGBA4. If it's RGBA8, um, then it will not show up in the character manager, the icon, it will just be the regular one. So, make sure it's RGBA4 and then it will show up. Um, I've known some people with issues that it didn't load in. So, but it's good. So we have the BCLM, so we can just remove the PNGs. So sorry if my laptop's a bit slow. It's not that good. Um, so now we'll make a UI SRC file. So I'm just going to the my stuff tools and to get an empty UI.sarc. So I'm just go to SRC folder and um, base.sarc. It's just empty, empty file. I'm going to already save it in um, in my Yoshi folder in the yellow Yoshi, and I already call it UI.src. So now to add them in the images, we need to do this. So we now select the map Yoshi R90. We need to fill in the path that it's normally in. So it's in race.ses. So we just type UI slash race dot ses and then map yoshi r90 dot bclem so and then it will show up here then go to rank yoshi ui menu ses rank yoshi dot bclem Also, we should add rank Yoshi again because it's not only in menu as it has, it's also in trophy.ses. So we just have to add it twice, but this time the trophy.ss. So rank Yoshi. Then we have the R90. So that's again race SLS. Race.ss. Rank Yoshi R90. And then we have uh, select Yoshi. So UI menu select Yoshi. Alright, so if you have done that, <coughs> if everything's in here, um, you can save it and you can test it out in your game. So I'm going to be doing that right now. I'm just going to fast forward you to the gameplay. So here we are with the gameplay. So if you now open the game settings, custom character, you'll see he's there. So that's his icon. Um, we can just go into the menu. Well, another issue with Citra again. But as you can see, 
Oh, that's the wrong one. My bad. There. There he is. So, if you go into the race, everything should work. And if it doesn't work, you either made a typo or it's just not in the UI arc. So, for cards, it's the same thing. But right now the game is bugged, but if you select the game, or the game, um, the character, if you select the character, um, you can, you, you'll see that you, the UI has changed. So, cards, gliders, and everything only go in menu SES, so it's kind of easy to mod. So, good luck with your um, UI arcs.